Hi guys, Scuffy Special here, back on another video. It's some really important breaking news about Nuno Espirito Santo's future at Tottenham Hotspur and a statement from Fabrizio Romano on Twitter and from Sky Sports News. So please stay watching until the very end about what's happening with Nuno Espirito Santo after a shocking 3-0 defeat at home to Manchester United. Daniel Levy is not happy and he's discussing um, Nuno Espirito Santo's future at the club currently as we are speaking. So please stay watching until the very end to find out this really important news. Please smash that subscribe button if you haven't already and that notifications button in the top right hand corner so you don't miss a single video. Thank you. Let's crack into today's video because it's really important. Um, so we've got a statement from Fabrizio Romano um, 38 minutes ago saying talks ongoing between Daniel Levy, Fabio Paratici and whole Tottenham board to decide on Nuno Espirito Santo's future. Under, which is under discussion. He could be sacked, but there's no decision made yet. And it's going to take some hours. That's what that, that, that is what he said. And another statement, this time from Sky Sports News, saying Nuno Espirito Santo's future at Tottenham is understood to be under discussion by Chairman Daniel Levy and the board. And another another tweet, this time from the Daily Hotspur. Um, Ryan Mason is set to be named as interim an interim coach. Manager again and could remain in position until Christmas, but that is not that obviously is not confirmed. Um, I believe more from Fabrizio Romano and Sky Sports News too, because Fabrizio Romano speaks to the agents of the Sky Sports News. They're massive. So um, at the moment, so um, Daniel Levy is called an emergency meet, emergency meeting with the board to discuss Nuno Espirito Santo's future at the club today, and it will take some hours and go through the night and could possibly. Uh, could go into tomorrow um it's there's no it's not clear what's going to happen but um it's an emergency meeting so it suggests that daniel levy's not happy about the defeat um he's not happy with nuno espirito santo but wants to get other people's opinions and perhaps if the majority say nuno out it will be nuno out and as i have said before guys um nuno's style of the club is not right um, for the players, for the philosophy, for the motto, for everything to do with the club. Nuno style, same with Mourinho, it's not right. But I do feel sorry for Nuno because he's a nice guy and has done nothing wrong, whereas Mourinho caused the problems by upsetting players. From what I can understand, Nuno is trying to prevent those problems um, and key to helping players um, in their development. Um, you know, it's more helping the team. Um, yeah, as I said, I, I do feel... Sorry for him. I do not think the players um, have given one hundred percent. For example, Harry Kane. I don't think he, he don't think he wants to play anymore. I don't think he's trying. Um, players like that, you know, they need to. I think they need to work a lot harder. Um, for example, I think Davis was very poor against Man United. Players like that, they need to work really hard. And I don't believe the manager. Like for example, United turned up for Solskjaer. Um, turns out we haven't done that. So just make this clear, there has been an emergency meeting within the last hour. Um, from Daniel Levy has called an emergency meeting with the Tottenham board to discuss Nuno Espirito Santo's future at the club. And I will let you know, guys, if there's any progress or any hint from anybody that Nuno Espirito Santo is going to be sacked tonight or tomorrow, I will let you know any developments with this. Thank you very much for watching this video. It is short, but it was really important. I do get um, did get this video across because it's big news, of course, to do with a head coach. The emergency meeting has been deployed, and it is my second video today. So I'm going to say it again. Happy Halloween, and take care. And I don't know when I'll see you next, depending on um, how far this um, talks go, whether they're just short talks about how long to give him or actually talks about possibly sacking him immediately after that disappointing defeat thank you for watching please smash that subscribe button if you haven't already and give this video a like and turn the notifications bell on in the top right corner so you don't miss any of my videos you have spurs news covered 24 7 24 7 with me the host of scarfy spurs talk which is me so thank you very much guys and as always you guessed it come on you spurs